hi friends welcome to this channel technology and invention so i already updated uh, uploaded the video on this channel related to the filling issues in cng system now i am making this video in english because i know very well that some of the users or some of the viewer of my channel is also from the location where they can not easily understand the language in which i am communicating so uh, for better understanding we are uh, converting this video in english so i try to convert my message in english to my viewers of south side or the areas where the hindi is not able to comfortably understand by the peoples okay so let's start the video so basically friends this video is made for the working of cng filling valves either your vehicle if it is tata ace mahindra supra and zito sml force aishar or any other vehicle so now uh, we are basically understanding the working of cng system means how cng filled inside our cylinder w uh, what are the main and major component used in this process okay so now what you are seeing in your screen this is the filling valve filling valve basically which we are using in our sml vehicles okay but with the help of this image with the help of uh, by understanding the working of filling Uh, only due to this part we are able to get that up to all the parts related to the cng fillings okay now let's start the video so what you are viewing front and top view of the filling valve so this is ngv natural gas valve and second one is nzs new zealand standard so the full form of nzs is new zealand standard because i think it is the i'm not sure about that okay but uh, what i get from my uh, basic knowledge so it is a uh, copy of new zealand standards okay that's why it is nzs so now these both both are filling ports in our filling nozzle we are also using the one filling port that is only this one in our tata ace supra okay but this is uh, lcb in the segment of sml came uh, with the segment of lcb that's why the two filling port is provided okay and it is also according to the manufacturer requirements okay so now this is ngb this is nzs and this is mechanical pressure gauge common for all cylinders and this is manual knob which we are using for closing and opening the line which is going towards the engine side which we are discuss in next slide okay so now further move on now what is the thing to understand in this this is the manual knob used for only closing and opening the gas line to, which is going towards the hpr side with the help of by uh, by passing through hp filter okay <clears throat> now we are moving on next slide and in this slide we are going to understand the type of complaint which we receive with this filling valve okay and another one second point if cng plus, uh, filling process is slow in our vehicle suppose most of the time customer is complaining again and again that the filling process is slow in comparison to the previous time so then in that case what we have to do and another third point is working of manual knob so now let's start the topic okay so first type of complaint with this filling valve or any other filling valve which have single filling port or two filling ports so now just now we are discussing this one so it is the first filling port and it is second filling port so first case case number 1 the gas start leakaging from the top portion from this portion during filling just get to the point where i want to take you okay means at the time of filling only the gas start leakaging from this portion that means the o ring the o ring which is mounted on mounting on the front portion of this filling valve if you see it from the front side i think you are also able to uh, see now this is the black color o ring which is fitted in the front of this filling valve uh, what is the use of this o ring at the time of filling it is completely fixed with the nozzle of the filling pump that's why there is no air gap or there is no uh, looseness of the filling nozzle that's why uh, cng is not leakaging at the time of filling so it is a common concern and uh, you can easily diagnose that by adding extra ring or by keeping the extra ring in your vehicle but second one if cng start leakaging from that portion after filling 
after filling that means once uh, when your cng is filled inside the cylinder and the gas start leakaging then what you have to do in that case you have to immediately resolve this issue with the help of any technician with the help of any cng mechanic okay so uh, how you can diagnose there is a uh, separate video on my channel also available that what is the child part which is used inside this filling valve so you can also search for that video on my channel content okay so no issue so we uh, if you require then we can also again made the separate video second uh, point of concern is cng start leakaging from this portion okay this is the second filling portion of our uh, filling valve so in that case if cng start leakaging from that portion then there is a nrv so we can further discuss in next video because uh, i want, didn't want to make it too long so uh, there is no need to confusion third point third point which is very important and necessary what you have to do in most of the areas where cng is recently launched so you can find only this filling nozzle there that is slow filling nozzle okay and it is highly risky filling nozzle in our filling system because the chances of entering the dust through this port is excess is more in compared to this one i will tell you the reason behind this further now we are uh, understanding the concern of slow filling so now at the time of filling if customer is complaining you that at the time of filling is gas is not properly filling or it is taking extra time in comparison to the previous one means at the starting time of the vehicle the vehicle filled only in 50 minutes now it is taking 20 or 25 minute then what you have to do there is a allen key screw of 6 mm you can see there there is a allen key screw of 6 mm with the help of 6 mm allen key you can open this but remember one thing always keep in mind you are working on cng system and it is a high pressure system so before opening any high pressure component you have to close all the high pressure line by closing the manual knob which is provided on the cylinders okay so by opening this 6 mm allen key nut you will find there is a filter inside it recently i have not not any picture of that uh, centered filter okay so by checking that center filter if you physically seeing that filter if it is black in color because at the time of new filter it is a golden in color so if you find that it is black or so much dust particle inserted over there that means the gallery which is going towards the engine side the gas galleries through that filter it is choked that's why uh, you have to replace okay you have to replace or bypass the filter because at the time of filling if uh, you are not uh, having that filter in your stock so by removing that filter you can directly fit that nut okay you can directly fit that nut and try to fill the gas again i am sure i am that sure that your vehicle concern of slow filling is will be resolved after this okay now uh, one more thing i want to add in this now you can see these two ports with this filling valve okay one is written with cyl that is cyl that is cylinder line and another one is eng eng that is engine line okay so now what is the meaning of that it is the cylinder line means it is open to the cylinder sides okay either whether we are closing this manual knob or not this line is always open for the cylinders okay this line is always open for the cylinders and this line is open and close with the help of this manual knob okay so at the time of filling if whether we are filling from this port we are filling from this port the gas towards this line uh, goes towards the first cylinder and these all cylinders are interconnected with each other okay so now at the time of filling if you are opening and closing this knob there is no effect on the vehicle and if you close that knob if you close that knob the gas stop to goes towards lp filter side or towards engine side if we close this manual knob if we close this manual knob then cng will not go towards the engine side so there is one more thing i want to add in this video at the last of this video that always confirm always confirm if you are operating this manual knob 
that the movement of this knob is proper that means that means it is on the proper open direction if you uh, if you leave it in the middle that it is not properly open in that case you will feel the concern of poor pickup or maybe the concern related to the starting so i am requesting you at the time of operating this knob always keep in mind you have to move it gently towards the open side and at the time of towards the closing side sorry towards the closing side and at the time of opening you have to move it again gently towards the opening side up to the end otherwise you will suffer and uh, uh, suffer a situation like the complaint of starting or poor pickup so that's it for the video i hope you will get something from this video if you like this video then definitely keep subscribe my channel i will also available with lot of videos in, in english for your help and also you can suggest me any such uh, type of uh, video related to your vehicle that is tata as mahindra supro mahindra jito sml force icer ashok leland is there any other vehicle related to cng system if you want any information then comment me i will be there with the video thanks thanks friend thank you very much